There's a very strange thing which comes from Emma. Emma is the European uh, Medical Agency. And the authorization for emergency uses of the magic potion for each manufacturer is near to expiring date. And officially it won't be um, gave an extension and on these things. Whether it's true or not is absolutely astonishing. How is it possible? Um, they're asking we're in the season of the third dose of the magic potion. And we've got countries which are trying to get rid of the old stock, encouraging taking um, the procedure, which is um, even that stock is um, near to expiring, expiring date as well as um, shelf life, like all products have. Even for the magic potion, there's a shelf life expiring date. Uh, Washington Post, there was an interesting article there which a friend of mine from the table uh, mentioned to me. And even it was mentioned on some independent um, broadcaster in Italy. It says, um, it's sufficient enough our, mu our immunity system is geared up and perfect enough to face the sickness. Instead of in luring people a taking um, this thing, we could have saved many thousands of lives. This could be true in one extent. It's true we have a beautiful full biological system, immunity system. And practically the sickness is like the flu basically. And in them cases who had the sickness, um, their immunity system efficiency is boosted up a lot more than uh, the person who received a magic potion or who never had it. Hence why our mums um, wanted us to catch the smallpox, measles and stuff like that. Like this, once we catch it and you're cured, your system your system, that immunity, will be a lot more stronger. Um, <clears throat> there are voices which um, are circulating inside these magic potions. Um, it could, they allegedly say it could destroy your immunity system up to 25% a shot. What about those um, people who are elderly or have serious health issues who end up in hospital with a double you know what and with all their health problems they got together they get the sickness and this sickness is the last nail in their coffin and then they die um, there's not much about they want us to know about this. They're saying it's still in phase of studying. And you want to impose these people to take this um, procedure. Going against any laws of that nation or constitution or international laws. If it's safe enough to take, okay. <coughs> the choice is ours to take it or not. But this sickness is not like it was, was like the Spanish flu a hundred years ago, which claimed more than 70 million lives in two years. We're about two years, around about four million and something people died. It's not certified they died from the sickness or not. 